Let me tell you about a stream four to seven miles in the sky, moving anywhere between 60 and 250 miles an hour, made of air. It's called the jet stream, and it's this week's weather word. I'm Storm Stream Meteorologist Jason Myers, and the jet stream is simply strong winds in the upper layers of the atmosphere that steer our weather here on the surface. It forms because heat from the sun is distributed unevenly across the Earth. We have colder air at the poles and warmer air near the equator. Where these two air masses meet is where the jet stream forms. The air begins to move because of the Coriolis effect, aka the Earth is always spinning. The jet stream doesn't always sit in one spot either. Sometimes it travels just straight west to east. Other times it meanders and buckles, traveling great distances to the north and to the south. Sometimes it can even split into two different streams. The jet stream is the main driving force in carrying weather systems around the world. It can also have a big effect on temperatures since the air north of it is very cold and the air south of it is very warm. This is especially true in the winter. What's the biggest stream you've ever crossed? Tell me about it in the comments below, and while you're down there, leave me another weather word. Or you can just tweet me or send me a message on the Storm Shield Facebook page. As always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you next week.